we have 34 at 20. So we start with 34, which is 3 tens and 4 units. And we want to add 20. So on a number line, we can start at 34. Now if we add 10, we have 44. And if we add another 10, we have 54. So we've added these two 10s, which means we've added 20. So 34 add 20 is 54. Now we have 22 plus 40. So we start with 22, which is two tens and two units. And we want to add 40. So on a number line, we can start at 22. And we're adding 40. So how many tens are we adding? There are four tens in 40, so we can add 10 four times. So if we add 10, we have 32. Add another 10, and we have 42. So now we've added two 10, so we've added 20. So let's keep going. Add another 10, and we have 52, so now we've added three tens, or 30, so we can add one more 10, and we have 62. So we've added 40, because we've added these four tens. 22 plus 40 equals 62. Now we have 57 add 40 on a number line. So we start on 57, and now what are we going to do? Well, we're adding 40, so let's add four tens. So add 10 to make 67, add another 10, make 77, another 10, 87, and one more 10, so that we've added four 10s, makes 97. So we've added 40, because we've added four 10s, we've added 10 four times. So 57 add 40 is 97. Now we have 19 plus 50, Pause the video, and using the number line to help you, see if you can add 19 and 50. Well, we're adding 50, so that's five tens. So we can add 10 to make 29, another 10, 39, another 10, 49, another 10, 59, and one more 10 makes 69. So we've added 50 because we've added five tens. We've added 10 five times. So 19 plus 50 is 69.